So well guys, here's a closer look at the figs that I've been eating recently uh, here in Alicante in Spain, uh, more specifically La Mata. Um, and pretty much every fruit and veg shop and supermarket seem to be selling the same type of figs at the moment. And they're all this variety which I've uh, found out is called albacore. And I think this is probably the most widely cultivated uh, variety of fig over here. Um, there are other varieties. A few years ago I was here and they had this one and a green one as well that had similar cracking. Um, but at the moment it's just these ones. Um, I think we're probably maybe uh, around mid-season so maybe some of the um, main crops haven't actually ripened up yet and this possibly is an early one because we're still at the end of July. Um, and you can see them in various stages of ripening. So this one really isn't fully ripe. It's quite hard. Um, you can see still we have this greenish uh, tint to it there. And this really wouldn't be uh, perfectly ripe. Now I get that when they're harvesting these that you can't pick them all perfectly ripe. Which is what uh, this one is. Or certainly looks like. Um, so you're going to get a mix of you know perfectly ripe to mid ripe to not so ripe. And that's just the nature of... Um, uh, agricultural uh, figs or agriculturally grown figs or production figs really uh, for market um, if they were grown uh, by the likes of myself we just grow for myself they'd probably all look like this before they get harvested anyway let's have a look inside this one um, I don't have a knife a hand so I'll just squish this one open so this is a fully ripe one here uh, nice and gooey and a slight red tinge um, but not too much and uh, some of the outer skin has gone a bit mouldy, so I'll just watch out for that. So I'll just try this one. And yet, you know, so when they're like this stage, they're very good. A uh, really good texture, nice seed crunch. They've probably been um, uh, pollinated by the fig wasp. Not particularly sweet. Uh, flavour is okay, it's mild. It definitely have much better. Um, I'll just try this one, maybe this one here, which is halfway ripe, just to give you an idea what they look like this side. So there, that one's not too bad, but you can see a bit less on the colour. Um, it's not so much red in there, although it's hard to see. Um, texture is a bit, looks a bit more on the dry side, so you're going to get maybe less sweetness and less flavour. But uh, yeah, not a bad fig, uh, not the best I've ever tasted, but... Um, it would be nice to see other varieties in the shop considering we're in the perfect climate for face but this is the, the one that you're probably more than likely going to come across if you're in this region of Europe. So that's uh, Albacore, I'm, I'm not sure if I'm actually pronouncing that right but um, I think it's spelled A-L-B-A-C-O-R. Um, anyway, there you go guys.